Hi, I'm Lisa Wigfall and welcome. In today's show, you will learn the four keys to setting up your business to win. Owning a business can be so, so rewarding. And I believe that building your business on a solid foundation is a truly major key for success. Now, I don't want to be the Grim Reaper, but according to the SBA, unfortunately, 18% of businesses fail in the first year and 50% fail within the first five years. No one wants this to happen to them, and I know you don't either. So keep listening to learn what it takes to start off on the right foot when starting your business and stay in business for the long term. Key number one, who are you? Determine what your business stands for. Remember that what is your company mission and heartbeat or lifeline is critical. What is the reason for its existence? Now, once you have determined your mission, you will be less likely to be distracted or taken off course or focus. You'll be able to keep your eye on the prize and that's to be successful. Number two, you're not in this alone. Customers are your lifeline. Stu Leonard, the world's most largest dairy store, which is my youngest favorite store and mine too, their motto, rule number one, the customer is always right. Rule number two, if the customer is ever wrong, reread rule number one. Customers are the lifeline to any business, especially for yours. Now providing exceptional customer service for your business should be the goal. Research cited on Zipia.com stated, following a poor customer experience, up to 89% of consumers have switched to a competitor. You may even be included in this 89%. They were not happy and they left and went to someone else. Now, when you're running a marathon, this is key number three. Pace yourself. Don't expand too wide, too fast. Allow your business to establish itself first, building momentum before expanding expanding too soon. Now here's some examples. Uh, moving into a space twice the size too soon. Significantly increasing staff, especially with the way staffing is now, too soon. Or franchising too early. Do regular check-ins. Keep your pulse on your business. Determine what the most popular products and services are. Don't get caught up on gimmick, but be aware of market trends and shifts so that you know when to pivot and alter part of your business model. Statistics show more than half of all global internet users buy something online every week. Numbers also say 61% of customers still want to try products in person before buying. So you've got to find your business's balance which is critical to creating a successful business with longevity. Fourth key and the last key is stay organized. Keep good records. Use an inventory and record keeping management system to keep track of daily operations. Keeping track daily is critical. Track your business to know sooner than later if you need to alter, pivot, or change directions. Those are the four tips or the four keys in building a strong, successful business. I hope that you found this helpful. If you can, take a moment to like this video. Also, if you haven't already subscribed to my channel, Maximizing You with me, Lisa Wigfall, hit that notification bell so that you can be notified of all new content. That is it for today. Until next time, I love to end my videos with this as best as you can. Remember to live, love, laugh, and smile. Until next time, bye.